Hello, it's Sap again from Make, and now in this video, I will show you how you can build an API that you can pull into any kind of interface or any kind of chat like OpenAI. You could use it for ChatGPT to build tools with it, or you could use it to query it from Slack when you want to build a Slack app or a Slack command or in, again, any other chat interface. So therefore, this is an advanced video. We are not going to show how you can build the chat interface or how you can build the chat setup in Slack or so, because this is on the other application, which belongs not to Make in this case. But we will show you how you can use the sales operator and what's the possibilities within Make with this. So without further ado, let's get to it. Imagine you're a sales account executive. And for example, you want to trigger this from agent force and in agent force, you have possibilities to use tools and you could define also a tool that works with make, of course. And in here you have your account executive briefing. So this breathing briefing, uh, gets used and triggered from here. So let me get to it. For example, you could send a message from your chat or from your triggering software solution, and you can send this to make. You have your API endpoint, which is basically this make webhook. And in here, you're using the message assistant. The message, message assistant works in this case, following way. You are going to give your operator following tools. This is how you can build advanced agents inside make. You are going to give it, for example, the right function, the create lead and check availability. So how are you going to use it? We are going to create these functionalities in here. And as I said in my previous video about tool usage and that you let the LLM decide which tools get used, you are going to prompt a specific explanation to it. You can write emails, create leads and CRM, check availability yet get availability function. You explain basically the agent when to use when and what, and then you give it its functions or its tools as it's more called in the AI space. Now with this set, you can now send along data from your user interface. In this case, we use the Chrome plugin and the message then gets sent along to the assistant and with the assistant and the system instructions or system prompt and the user message, it will ideate which tools to use. And in this case, it can use Gmail, for example. So as I said previously, it can then from OpenAI trigger here the create email or write email one. And here we define it precisely. And let me show you this. So we are firing it up here and sending it to the Gmail. So with this, we have the option to use tools in make today, and you can use it with open AI directly inside make. And here you can see the last tool, which we kind of staged for the demo purposes. So if you have questions, feel free to comment below or let us know, and we're happy to support you and getting to know more how to use assistance inside OpenAI and make so you can call it from any other tool like Slack or Agent Force or so on and so forth.